What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Susie. It is raining outside. I love the rain. It's like, it means that everybody is inside and no one is out on the street making noise and it is a beautiful thing. Right, anyway, shut up Susie, get on with it. <laughs> We're back. The Aurochs may have lost the game. I know but we what lost. Way to go. We got to the finals. And we can't really say that we've done that before because Yeah. Well, I'm going to go ahead and save it um anyway. Let's go over this one. So many different saves. I actually lose count. I just want to say this We'll probably have a lot of cutscenes in this episode. Um, this game has a lot of cutscenes anyway, but there's a lot that happens in this episode, cutscene-wise. So, just, just to warn you, just to warn you. You know what I don't understand at this point is the fact that no one comes in to help us. Like, you can't tell me that there's no one else that can blitz and fight underwater. It's nonsense. Out. Absolute nonsense. Right, so I'm gonna put haste on both of us. This does take a wee while. I'm doing dark attack because... Yeah, if it doesn't kill them, then they can't hit us. But I have just noticed how Dark Attack doesn't really do like that much damage, so. Wait, what are they immune to? Oh, he's got poison. He's got poison on his ball. Sounds a bit weird, but whatever. I am binging this game today, by the way. I find when I sit down to play this game, I just play it for hours and hours and hours. I kind of get lost in the story a little bit. Easy enough to do though. So I was wanting to ask you guys, so I got these new headphones, um, they're Samson headphones, and I, I don't like them. Now, I can't seem to find headphones that I really like. I don't like the big over the head headphones because they make my hair go really funny. So, do you guys know of any decent headphones like these, like the normal ones? Just for like, when you're out and about and just for recording as well. I just cannot seem to find any decent ones. Like, I don't mind paying a bit of money, that doesn't bother me, but just to have good quality. Haste is really working for us both right now. many is there? Really? Take that. I'm almost at my favorite grinding spot as well. I can't wait to get to that bit because then I'm just gonna run up and down the Meehan high road and just grind and grind and grind. This is probably, the sad thing is, this is the, probably the last time I'm gonna play this game like all the way through because it's a big commitment and when you're leveling up and wanting to do like everything a hundred percent it takes a long time so it's kind of sad when I think of it that way so I'm gonna embrace it and enjoy it Go on, Orin. Okay, 
Okay, let's see what we've got. We'll go for power break. What? I was just getting started with that fight. Okay, never mind. So, you do know him? Yeah, best guardian there ever was. Go away, Zoo Bird. Is it called Zoo? I think it's called Zoo. Let's use Cheer. I don't know if I can hit it because it's a flyby.com. Suppose we could try. No, I don't have anything. Um, do I have any ethers? No. I want to try and put a dark attack on it if I can. How dare you? Okay, and let's go for haste on not no not the enemy on Orin, please. Actually, I totally forgot about this fight. Oh, it's not a zoo. Thought it was zoo. Garuda. Ha ha! You missed. Orin's gonna kick your butt. You do know this. Oh, we have to cure. Oh, I poisoned it. Nice. Nice. I don't, it's got like a counter attack that it's doing and it's a pain in the butt. Right, I'm gonna potion myself. Yeah. Miss. What? How is it getting, <laughs> getting double the moves? You die. Thank you. Sin is getting too close for comfort. My feet are killing me today. Don't buy pumps. Pumps are really bad for your feet. They look nice, but they're really bad for you. Girls, that's two girls. Uh oh. Hey, give me a break. Chills. <sighs> Anima is just wild. His overdrive, I say he, assuming gender. His overdrive is insane. Oblivion, it's crazy. You're really leaving, Captain? Doggy! Shouldn't you heal up first? Yuna needs me with her now. I can't be lying around in some bed. Yeah, but... Come on, look sharp! The blitz season just started. Don't make those faces, yeah? Well, see ya, boys. But we lost. You be good. Captain. Um, I can't hear you. Captain. You guys will be fine. I will manage you. We'll be good. Are you sure? Never liked long goodbyes anyway. Sorry for making you wait, Yuna. I had some promises to keep, yeah? 
From now on, I'm your full-time guardian. Then welcome back, Sir Waka. Good to have you with us. Hey. It's good to be back, yeah? So, any news on what happened? Not really. We don't know where the fiends came from. Maester Micah is safe and sound, thanks to Maester Seymour. That's about it. Maester Seymour's Aeon... It was so powerful. Don't worry, we'll get it soon enough. <gasps> There's two chests behind there. Hey you! Don't just stand there! All of this is your fault! Getting swallowed by Sin, ending up here in Spira, not being able to go back to Xanark, and everything, everything! I'm telling you, it's all your fault! <laughs> Don't you start with the ha ha ha's. Who are you anyway? You knew my old man, didn't you? Yeah. And you also knew Yuna's father? That's correct. Hey man, there's no way. That's just impossible. Nothing impossible about it. Jacked, Roska, and I. Together we defeated Sin ten years ago. Then I went to Xanarkand, where I watched over you. So that one day I could bring you to Spira. Why did it have to be me? Jack asked me to. Is he alive? It depends on what you mean by alive. I mean, is, is he a person? <laughs> no longer human. But then, I felt something object there in that shell, couldn't you? You must have felt him when you came in contact with Sin. It can't be. It is. Sin is checked. Uh, no, that's ridiculous! No way! I don't believe you! But it is the truth. You'll see for yourself. Come with me. If I say no? Every story must have an ending. I don't care about your stories! I see. Sorry you feel that way. Fine then. Come or don't come, it's your decision. What am I supposed to say? You tell me it's my decision! But I don't have a choice, do I? You're the only one who can tell me what's going on anyways! I have to go with you! I have to! Irritating. I know. Or are you afraid? Always makes me so sad, this cutscene. Right. Will I ever go home? Back to Xanarkand? That's up to Jekt. I'm going to offer my services to Yuna. Come. Imagine finding out that the thing that's destroying everyone's lives is your dad. I mean, what? You know what I mean? It's just it's one of those moments that you literally, it's like the oh my god moment of this game is that moment where it's like, sin is jacked. Those three words. Save my life. What was that Cheryl Cole song again? 
Alright, so there should be an Albed Primer down here. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it. A, B, C, D, E, F, 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 F. That's my sixth one. Let's get this chest real quick. Yeah, I understand he didn't have a great relationship with his dad. But you imagine you've just been transported into the future. Your life is totally upside down. And it turns out that it's your dad's fault. Well, no. I'm not going to say anymore. I'm not going to say anything at all. Because I'm trying to... When I'm talking about the story, I'm being very careful with my words because there's a lot of new people watching this game for the first time with me. So I'm not just going to say any spoilers. Hey, doggy! Hopefully my dog Finn has gotten a lady pregnant. <laughs> and um, they'll be having puppies gonna stay soon. Here. Sir Oren knows him, apparently. You were right. He did meet someone he knew. Do you think he'll find a way back to Xanarkand? In any case, I'll miss having him around. He's still in town, isn't he? I think I'll go see him. Oh! Whoa! Sir Oren! Yuna. Sir. I wish to become your guardian. Do you accept? Uh, You're serious? You refuse. No, no. We accept, right, everyone? Uh, of course. No problem at all. But why? I promised Braska. You promised my father? Thank you, Sir Oren. You're welcome to join us. And... he comes too. Hi, guys. Uh, howdy. This one I promised Jekt. Is Sir Jekt alive? Can't say. Haven't seen him in ten years. I... see. You'll meet eventually. Yes, I'm looking forward to it. What's our itinerary? Where are we headed? Hey, come with me. Okay, I'm just gonna go out there and say it. If anyone disses this next cutscene, I will not be happy. It's one of the most cringiest beautiful cutscenes there and people need to follow it in everyday life you'll know what i'm talking about hey watch <gasps> ah. hey you got pretty good you sound sad yeah maybe Want to scream? Mm, I really don't think that's gonna help this time. You know what? Hmm? It's embarrassing to say this myself, but summoners and their guardians are kind of like Spira's ray of light. A lot of people in Spira depend on us. I learned to practice smiling. When I'm feeling sad, you know. <laughs> I know it's hard. Yeah. I understand. I think. Right. Now let's see what you can do. Huh? Come on. Uh, uh. Too much Botox. <laughs> this is weird. Next, try laughing out loud. What? Come on, show me. Uh, 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 uh. 
I almost want to do it with him, just cause. Separated, just whistle. I'll come running. I promise. Mm. <laughs> well, let's go. I love that cutscene. Just something about it, like I don't know. What are you looking at? We were just worried you guys might have gone crazy. Sorry. Well mm -hmm. then, all right. Now, we will go to the temple at Jose. And guardians, don't forget to smile. Ha 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 ha. I was discussing this in my Discord today, actually. Because we were like, what do you want to do? Like, scream real loud. What about laughing out loud? <laughs> Such an iconic moment in this game. So this was what I was talking about in regards to a great place to grind. And also, for the first time in the game, you can actually play Blitzball. Which is highly addictive, by the way, I am gonna say. Is there a chest here? What? Why would it let me go to the right when there's no chest there? What a bunch of baloney. Baloobi. <gasps> this guy likes to talk. This is a statue of Lord Meehan. Eight centuries ago, he founded a legion known today as the Crusaders. In just a few short years after their founding, their ranks grew throughout Spira. The maesters of Yevon feared an uprising and accused them of rebellion. So Lord Meehan walked along this very road to go face their charges and refute them. He succeeded in winning the maesters' trust and his legion became an arm of the Yevon clergy. It was then that Yevon gave them the name Crusaders, which they have kept ever since. And the rest is history. No, you're supposed to say, and that, as they say, is that. That's what you always say. Thank you. So we finally have our characters, actually, but we still don't have any ability spheres. Oh, getting really angry about that now. I always have this issue when I play this game. No, none at all. Where are you going? Uh, you're going down this way. Kind of annoying that he's got a level 3 there. And he's right next to zombie attack. That would be a good one to moo. Uh, to have. To moo. Moo! I'd like to have a level 1. Do I have a level 1 spear yet? No. Ugh. Right, no such luck. Let's carry on. Huh. That one looks slow. It's also tough. Let me handle this. No way! I can take it! Go on then, Titus. What the? <laughs> Told ya, Sir Arn's the best! 
<laughs> I could have done that. Yeah, I could have done that. Walker's head when he's doing that looks so weird. I don't know. Creeps me out a little bit. Ah! Give me an ability spear! So annoying. Hello. No, it's not what I need. We're gonna have a summoner fight pretty soon as well. Do you know what those ruins are from? Um, no. Some old city? Correct. A city most ancient. A terrible testament to sin's power. I tremble every time I see them. Compared to sin, humans are mere mud puppies. But I believe humans are the only ones capable of defeating sin. A good reply. I am relieved to hear you say that, Milady Summoner. Oh? Where are my manners? I am matron, a scholar, at your service, Milady. I am on a journey, studying the history of our world, Spira, seeking its stories and secrets. My travels have taken me to many places, and I am troubled by what I have seen. Fragile smiles on people's faces, crumbling at the mere mention of sin. They are counting on you, milady. Give them a reason to rejoice once more. I will. And that, as they say, is that! Do 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 do! Nice. Right, let's have Lulu. I'm gonna try and use Kamari as much as I can, even though he's kind of pointless at the moment. I just need ability spheres. That's all I need. Let's get Orin into the fight. Enough. Enough. Da, da, da. Please. I swear, this game is just... It's trolling me. I'm pretty sure there's a... Aha! Get it. We're gonna have a summoner fight between... It's gonna be what we like to call the battle of the Aeons. I think that is our lady friend down there. Chokies! Lady Summoner, I presume. Yes, I am Yuna. I am Lucille, captain of the Jose Chocobo Knights. And I'm Alma. We've been charged to guard the high road. There have been reports of a large fiend appearing in this area with a taste for chocobos. Do take care, Summoner Yuna, if you are to rent any chocobos. Thank you. We will be careful. Good. We should get back to our rounds. Farewell. Our prayers are with you. Thank you. I swear, if I saw anything eating a chocobo, it would destroy me. A large me. fiend? Hmm. Let's go get him! Why? It's the right thing to do. It's the right thing to do. <laughs> What'd I say now? Jekt said that a lot too. <laughs> and every time he said it, it meant trouble for Braska and me. <laughs> <laughs> Like father, like son. So, there is our battle of the Aeons, and we will do that in the next video. But unfortunately guys, that is all I've got time for in this episode of Final Fantasy. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye!